I want to die. I may have multiple women involved in my life, but there's always going to be that woman for me. And every other woman is going to know that. Yeah, that Hey guys welcome back to my youtube channel this is sandra orokudo and this is the anything talk so last night after the saturday party at the big brother house um michael and jackie b had an extensive conversation like it was quite expressive plus i sincerely felt like the reason for that conversation was because jackie b had been giving michael the vibe that she no longer cares okay even though i know she actually does care but she had been giving this you know whatever vibe now before the party uh, about two days ago michael and angel had the conversation after jackie b and angel had a conversation there's so many conversations going on in this house they're always having one okay so Jackie B was telling Angel about the situation she had with Michael and how it's uncomfortable for her to keep talking to Michael because of uh, him flirting or hitting or something, having something to do with Angel. Angel didn't really say much. But when she went back to Michael, they had a conversation about how Jackie B had a conversation with Angel and how Angel, Angel told Michael that she was sure that Jackie B was going to, you know, call him and talk to him pretty soon. And that happened on Saturday. Jackie B really did talk to him and she told him how she felt about him shoving her aside, even though shoving her aside during the Perry and White Money saga about the Whispering Game and all. But I felt like that, that happened in the heat of the moment and it wasn't really anything deep. But that being said, uh, Michael said it wasn't that deep and he did not even know because he was just shoving people aside because of the heat and the heated argument. So... Today, Jackie B and Michael were having a conversation in the kitchen, first of all, and then they had another conversation at the garden. Now, the whole crux of the thing is Michael cannot um, fathom why Jackie B no longer cares. So he goes, okay, you don't care about me or what? And she's like, she did, but she really doesn't care anymore. Now she could care less. And Jackie B said she has a hard time processing or uh, relaying her points to people so or not just relaying her emotions or how she feels to people so she told michael that what she's trying to say is not like she doesn't care about him but she now cares less you know whatever happens should happen and michael says he really cares about her i don't understand what michael is going about i mean he was telling angel that his kind of girl is a girl that allows him to touch her in several places even if they are just friends he's going to hold her ass and spank her or something like that even if they are just friends and he told angel that Jackie B is so uptight, she's not his kind of girl. So I don't know why he's here talking to Angel today and he's like, he really likes her, he cares about her and he would want them to have, okay, not like he, he would want them to have something special. He didn't say that expressly, but he just wanted to know if Jackie B cares about him and she said she cares about him. Okay, so they went to the lounge, they went to the garden, sorry, and they were having this conversation about uh, why things were the way they were with them and he said when he got into the house he was Jackie B he actually really was close to and connected with and Jackie confirmed the same thing and she's like the things she gets upset about before with him she doesn't get she doesn't get upset about it and she was telling him that she's not the kind of girl that goes around with different guys or let different guys do stuff to her because she was in a in the head of house room with Buma for a whole week and nothing happened between them and that was true nothing happened between them and she was just telling him that you know what i i know this is a complicated situation but i really don't mind anymore whatever goes on should just go on and michael starts going now this is where michael pulls the future okay he went on and on about how you know he's been he's been here before and he thinks that um jackie b is awesome and <laughs> he's a one woman man but there may be other women in his life but then there's that there, there's just that one woman that he's going to be into now i don't understand how you will be telling a woman that there will be one you are a one woman man and at the same time juxtapose it with there will be other women, but it is just you. Meaning, you're not a one woman man. Michael was saying a lot of things last night and I could not even fathom or understand where he was coming from. What I felt was happening was that 
He did not understand why Jackie B would not care anymore. Like, why, why would you care less? I want you to be hung over me. Be into me so that I can shove you aside and do whatever I like and make you feel bad. If I do, even though I don't want to have you, just be into me. So the fact that Jackie B was not giving him the response that, uh, yeah, I like you, I want you and all that. Because he told her that, you know what, he wants... He he went came to the house and discovered that Jack, Jackie had a family. She had a son, like she she had a whole family outside. And she was like, that's true, and they're important to her. Those things are things that she cannot, you know, exchange for anything else. But she's an aunt, and she's okay being single if the person she wants to be with cannot carry all that. So he went on and on about how that is going to affect them or how that has affected things between them and show that she's really okay with that and he goes he's just looking for a woman that you know would um be with him throughout and would well, love him and that. care for him and jackie I mean, was like yeah she wishes him that and she also and she also wishes to have someone like that someone that would love her for her and that can entertain the baggage that she brings so michael wasn't having it he was still going on about how he really liked her and in his regular manner he was just trying to convince her totally and i'm quite happy that jackie didn't give him the response that she that he wanted to hear which was that she was really into him and she really cared about him because she was all about you know what no problem just do you this i'm cool with that and i'm cool with nothing happening between us because he was like he thought about the outside and then he saw like so he apologized for talking about what will happen outside of or projecting that far but he saw her son and all the family and he just really felt overwhelmed and stuff so she was like that's okay and if he cannot do that it's fine by her she's willing to be um single for that long so i'm really happy she didn't give him the response he was expecting and i just hope i just hope she can just get done with michael because it is not a good look for her she keeps saying her son is watching this show whatever reason i don't know why he's watching the show but then i just hope she can leave this whole michael situation it is not a good look i'm sick of it like just leave the guy to go and be with someone that is his type or someone that can understand what he's doing because girl he just want. i feel like he's just playing and stringing jackie b and he wants to put her in that emotional cocoon that she's not going to come out from but i'm happy at her responses she wasn't giving him the responses he was he wanted so i'm happy i want to see what will happen now because She's getting too cozy with him, even though they're having this... It seems like she likes the conversation. She just wants to keep having them. But I just want her to be done and be done. So, guys, please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to like and to comment your thoughts on this. Let me know what you think, guys. And, oh, my God. It, I will talk about Emmanuel later in another video. I'll talk about him later. So, bye.